In this video I show you today the most likely last color pictures of the historic Potsdam Garrison Church, which the pastor Dietmar Seretz made in May 1968 with great difficulty, shortly before the demolition. These were made available to me by Dietmar Seretz's family with the support of the Garrison Church Foundation and represent an important document of the times. The Garrison Church was a Protestant church in the historic center of Potsdam, whose tower has been under reconstruction since 2017 with the help of private donations. Built by order of Prussian King Frederick William I according to plans by architect Philip Gerlach in 1730-1735, it was considered a major work of the North German Baroque. With a tower height of almost 90 meters, it was the tallest building in Potsdam and, together with the Nicole Kirsch and the Heiliggeist Kirche, dominated the cityscape in the Driekirchenblick. A few weeks before the end of World War II, it was severely damaged by a British air raid during the night of Potsdam on April 14, 1945. The interior of the nave burned out and the tower with the carillon partially collapsed. Dietmar Seretz comes from Cottbus and was previously a Lutheran pastor in Waldsiversdorf near Berlin and lived in Potsdam from 1961 to 1990. Here he was the parish priest of the Friedenskirche for 19 years and was also close to the Garrison Church. At that time, Seretz heard the news about the imminent expropriation of the Garrison Church by the state from Potsdam's Protestant superintendent Rolf Stuba. Stuba handed Seretz the key to the Garrison Church with the request that he take photos. Seretz, a passionate amateur photographer, then set off with his camera. In the Garrison Church, he then took great pains and risks to take the photos of the interior and exterior of the church, as well as the top of the tower. The approximately 70 photos impressively show how the Garrison Church enriched Potsdam cityscape and that it was part of the everyday life of the people of Potsdam with the Heiligkreuz Kapelle set up in it. After a first failed attempt, the tower was blown up on a Sunday at service time at the behest of Walter Ulbricht, the chairman of the GDR State Council. Prior to this, the city and the church had presented a concept for securing the church, which was not taken into consideration. Like many other war-damaged but intact sacred buildings in East Germany, the ruins of the garrison church fell victim to ideologically and communistically motivated socialist urban planning. Pastor Seretz also commented on the reconstruction of the garrison church, I found its demolition painful. Rebuilding it will fill a gap in Potsdam cityscape and in the consciousness of Potsdamers, and will set a sign for peace and reconciliation. Today, his invaluable pictures contribute much to the reconstruction and provide important information for the building reconstruction. Even today, the reconstruction of the church is still actively criticized by leftist, communist parties and groups. In this context I would like to point out that the project still needs donations. You can find a link under the details.
If you like my videos, then subscribe to my channel here to see my latest videos. If you want to see another video directly, then click here. Interesting videos can also be found here.